The Supreme Court in Nigeria cannot be trusted, right? We saw the Imo State Governor removed and somebody who was from fourth position was taken to the first position. And now we have the case of Bayasa where the deputy is being removed. Just yesterday they said the case was dismissed, but today the court led by five the five man panel led by uh this is uh Mary Peter Odili has removed the man who is supposed to be sworn in, right? And that is really, really bad. We no more have confidence in the courts of the land. Look at what is actually happening with the case of Ihedioha. It's very, very despicable. So we need to regime our system. Essentially, people no more have faith in the Supreme Court of the land anymore. Uh, we have uh, so worried going to court yesterday and it was awarded 200,000 naira. There is no justice in the land, right? Anybody can be injured and a lot of things are going on. Just look at yesterday, the president was good. See, for the president to be good, it should have the thing paying them. You know, it's easy to tell somebody, well, we are on top of the situation, blah, blah, blah. When these people, their relatives have been killed, right? Do you know how many widows have been made from these Boko Haram insurgents? Do you know how many orphans have been made from these insurgents? And we're hearing reports that 1,400 uh, of these terrorists have been declared repentant, have been launched into society. Well, Professor Itse Sage condemning that, right? How about Apostle Joseph Suleiman condemning that? How about Femi Fani Kayode condemning that? And every every single person is actually condemning the acts of the federal government. Because, like I said yesterday in the video, those who are fighting for terrorism are fighting for a cause. The one who is kidnapping people is doing that because he needs money. The one who is fighting terrorism, who is fighting because of terrorism, is not doing that because of money. There is a cause. So what is Boko Haram? It says that Western education and civilization is what? Bad. So they are fighting the Western system. These are the things that happen in the nation. Now, President Buhari left Bono State. And after leaving, few hours, another community was what? Was attacked. And somebody said, in the war against terrorism, there is no sincerity on the part of the government. Uh, we saw the attack on Bono State, right? Uh, one of the men was talking about that citizens are to be blamed, right? We see Bolustan government giving the report. Oh, these are the number of people that we are killed. X number we are killed. And they were the government saying that Y number of people we are killed. This is the control here. Yeah. Do you know many people voted for Buhari? 800 something thousand people voted for, for Buhari. And it was good when he went there yesterday. And we're talking about the clamoring for the sack of the Supreme uh, Judges. Oh, sorry, was the, the sack of the service ships, and nobody's giving us an ear. There is insecurity in the land. So, those who are saying that is it, uh, Boko Haram has been defeated need to rethink because this thing is not true. Boko Haram is still strong, it's still heavy. So, President Buhari and his cohorts, when the government need to do something before something to us. Here's my take. Peace.